that lady there is so hard. She's barely <laughs> so said anything. High. Like, I don't even know if she realized she's in a video. She's just like eating the snacks real slowly and enjoying them and not saying a word. <laughs> Today, we are reacting to stoned Americans eat Australian snacks. I wonder how Australian snacks are going to hold up. Wow. Yeah, they will totally be like, whoa. Yeah. This is not like the one we have here. Is that a kangaroo? Oh, no. It's got to be stuff that you can just like keep eating, right? Because yeah. I've always seen them, they just like keep eating. Yeah. Like, blah, blah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. yeah. Now, um, the ganj, the marijuana, isn't legal here. Marijuana. It's a drug, and um... <laughs> marijuana is a drug, and that's all we're gonna say. Let's watch yeah. the video. Stoned Americans eat Australian snacks and lots of smoke, smoke. because it's like smoke. I'm probably like how high are you right now? Yeah, I was gonna say like a six, seven. I'm like a nine, maybe. Maybe I'm a nine also. Can we just talk about that for a minute? A nine yeah. out of ten. If we're thinking about like drinking, yeah, like when you're a nine out of ten, that's like can't really like function. <laughs> Definitely not doing any work after this. What, what's the question? <laughs> oh, look how red their eyes are. <laughs> Filming this would have been fun. Vegemite on toast. It's not toasted. Not toasted. I've never heard anyone speak positively. They're going to eat Vegemite on toast. They're not going to like it. They're going to hate it. <laughs> oh my God, oh, what wow. is it? It's a lot happening. Oh wow. It's really salty, which I love. I imagine that eventually you stop making this facial expression while eating it. This guy is oh. so stoked. He's about to cry. <laughs> yeah. Are you okay? You don't have to do this. I just think like the time to try Vegemite on toast is probably not in this state. The fact that they've done it yeah. on plain bread without toasting it is just blasphemy. And they've also got like a bit too much exactly. Vegemite they've on there. They've done it Nutella style, which is not how you do it at all. Fairy bread would be really good. I don't know if that's in this video. They should have tried yeah. fairy bread. Come down to BuzzFeed Oz, we'll make you proper Vegemite toast. I'm so sorry you had to go through this. Yeah. Eucalyptus so drops? I did not expect this. It's just like, just a normal candy. These are gonna be bad, I think, for them. Yeah. This is the best thing I've ever put in my mouth. What am I tasting? This is relaxing. It's like a palate cleanser. This is not a stoner food yeah. for me. Yeah, I wouldn't call them a snack. No. I'd call them like, the equivalent of like a fun mint. I have never seen anyone like over the age of 14 or under the age of 88 them. So far, I think the key to like the perfect Australian stone snacks are ones that not only taste good, have texture, but also add an element of game. And that's what the game. eucalyptus drops do. Yeah. You know? I like that. It's soccer in your mouth. Tim Tam. Tim Tam. Oh, hell yeah. It's classic. Great. Now we're talking. A brand new culinary experience. They know what's up. They're also, gonna like love it. They're eating it. Can I have another one? <laughs> yeah. It's good. These are like the Girl Scout cookies of Australia. I'm super into these. Whatever hype that you have heard, I'm sure this is living up to that. Don't lose up. Oh my god. They're great. They must be in heaven right now. Yeah. Like, I'm gonna have one. Yeah. And then, and then you like, have the whole box. Eat the whole packet. Monster. Stoned yeah. or not stoned, you're eating that whole packet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cheezles! Cheezles! Oh my god, look at them putting their hands okay. in them. I am pro cheezles. Okay, She's pro cheezles. They're meant They're to go on your finger like that. Look at that. Are they? I think I'm in love with cheezles. I'd move in with cheezles. <laughs> I could see myself taking cheezles home to meet my parents. This is a good donor food. You know what I want to say to cheezles? <gasps> no! Oh I my do. god! Thank I you so do. I do cheezles. Oh, one finger. Put it on ten. Oh, yes! That's a huge hit with Americans. They yeah. love the cheesels. Yeah. That's a huge hit. That's um, a great, great stone snack, I reckon. Like perfect. cheesy. And really like artificial cheese as yeah. well. That, maybe that's so why strong. the Americans liked it so much because their cheese is orange. Milo. Milo. Wrong. Let's give it a try. Oh, it just kills me. I'm so sorry when people put Milo after the milk. Okay, there's an... <laughs> You don't have to do it that way. Hopefully we'll be running like this girl playing soccer. And it's like Nesquik, kind of. Some people eat it dry. I feel like I'll forget how to swallow. Well, you have this right here if you forget. It doesn't taste as bad as it smells. Does it smell bad? It smells great. I that was nice. Put some on my arms and I yeah. leave, you know? <laughs> That's my exfoliant. <laughs> I feel like eating a spoon of Milo is not what you want to do while you're- Oh, that's 
Oh, nice. she yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> I think it's tricking me that it's good for me. My kid is It is tricking you. One of these guys is like really into all of them. Like he's got like, must have a strain blood in him or something. Like he's into it. Everyone else is like, what are these? Or he's a nine out of 10 star. <laughs> Yeah, I think maybe they were expecting like a chocolate flavor, whereas that's yes. more like malt. Yeah, right? like Nesquik or something yeah. like that, which is like super, super, super sweet. So they probably did get tricked a bit. I don't know if anyone ever had a bottle of lemonade in their fridge and went to open it up and pour a glass and it's not actually lemonade, someone's just refilled it with water. Or it's tonic water. So. Oh, that was the yeah. worst. Yeah, that'd be bad. Caramello koala. Caramello koala. Yeah. They're a big deal, huh? Delicious. They're vicious, I hear. Look at this guy. Kind of hot. It's kind of hot. I'm sorry. Pause. Uh, what? A koala hot? Mm, koalas are like cute and cuddly. They're like, like grandpa cute. Yes. Like they look like little grandpas. Yeah, like an old man. I don't know why she was like. He's kind of like no. Would you rather a Freddo or a koala? Camera koala. Like who would you swipe right yeah. on Tinder? Yeah. Both, obviously. I'm sad that it's so cute. Because like there is a little bit of me that is not enjoying biting the heads off of things. Oh, that's like that sounds like a classic thing. Like you know, you have empathy. That's a, such oh. a like a high thing. You're thinking about everyone's feeling. I don't know. But, yeah, like when I used to eat tiny teddies as a kid, I would bite their head off and then all of their arms and legs and then eat the body. What I'm saying is, if you were stoned, you wouldn't have done that. <laughs> Because you think about it more. I would hope I wasn't stoned as a child. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. This tastes like Easter candy. It's like a Fair Hershey's enough. chocolate bar. Any the caramel, caramel from like Twix. These are really sweet. 10 out of yep. 10 would munch on koalas again. Yep. <laughs> oh! 10 out of 10 would munch on koalas again. I mean, Twisties. it's Twisties. I love Twisties so much. All tastes way more natural than the food that we eat, though. I will say that. Yeah, absolutely. Some snacks, are, like Australian snacks, are really not healthy. Mm -hmm. I feel like we try and um, masquerade them as healthy snacks. Like, it's so good for you. It's not good for you. I mean, they're really good, but... Version of Cheetos. Oh, um, way. sorry. No. Absolutely not. Cheetos are the American version of Twisties. We came first. Obviously, what came first, the chicken or the egg? Obviously, the twisties. The twisty or the Cheeto. <laughs> I feel like twisties and your Cheetos are very different things, right? You really can't compare the two because they're different they live... shapes. Yeah. To start off with. Mm -hmm. That's no. You're using sarcasm. I'm being serious. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, like twisties are a bit more dense. It takes a bit more to crunch through them. Yeah. Cheetos have a bit more air. They're softer. They're easier to chew. And Cheetos are spicy as hell. The Tweetos. Are... Tweetos. <laughs> I just spat everywhere. I think I'm going to contact her for this video. <laughs> Tweetos. Like a bugle. If anybody's ever. Ooh, it does taste like a bugle. I don't know if I eat these bugs. <laughs> Why not? He says as he's like shoving them in his mouth. In my parents' basement. He's hugging the twisties. I'm on board with twisties. Yeah. That lady there is so hot. <laughs> She's barely said anything. Like. <laughs> I don't even know if she realized she's in a video. She's just like eating the snacks real slowly and enjoying them and not saying a word. And then the other guy is just whispering. <laughs> it's poor little head. I bit it off. I bit it off. Twisties are the Australian version of Cheetos. Australians can't get Final thoughts. Food. It's illegal? Yes, it's illegal. You guys illegal. are a country that started from criminals. <laughs> I couldn't that. Yeah. I liked probably like seventy-five percent, sixty-five percent of them. I think this is great stoner food. Jim Jam. <laughs> <laughs> Boing. <laughs> this is dating profile picture, and here's what he looks like when you meet him in real life. I reckon uh -oh. this guy was the most stoned in the pink shirt. He seemed very stoned. So was, was his like female? A, yeah. A comp colleague. Colleague. That video went just as I kind of expected it. So from watching this video, I reckon the perfect stoner snack has to be something that's like pretty intense in flavor. Yeah, yeah. or like a weird combination of things. Yeah. Or like... And something you can just really like reach in and just be like... <laughs> Weed still is not legal in Australia, so... Don't do it. Don't do it. So just remember what Healthy Harold taught you and... Stay safe!